What is up guys, it's Soulbash. We are back again with another video on Mobile Legends and today we're going to talk about another thing that sets you apart in the arena which is runes. Before we do get into that, I want to let you know guys, we have been live streaming this quite a bit here lately. We're going to go through a set schedule probably somewhere around noon to 3 o'clock at Central Time in the United States. Uh, so if you want to catch up with the stream, we'll probably be streaming at that time pretty much every day starting next week. And we'll be randomly streaming at night as well. Uh, if you want to follow me, if you're already here on YouTube, hit the subscribe button. You'll get notified when I go live. If not, we're also streaming over on Twitch as well at the same time. You can follow me there at twitch.tv slash soulbashgaming. And you can also follow me on Twitter at soulbashgaming. Uh, you'll find out when I do go live. And runes are what we're going to be talking about. And here is your tab. It's right there. I'll highlight it for you. Go into it there. And you can see that you have a lot going on and it might be a little confusing to begin with, but I'm going to explain it all to you. So in the beginning, you don't have all of these unlocked. I've still got one more to unlock and that is from your veterancy. Uh, you're going to need skilled veterancy five before you unlock everything. So as you go along, you're going to get more and more. So let's go back in here and take a look at what you have. You have three water runes, three fire, earth, wind, and spirit. So you have elements on the runes, and each of them have different categories. Uh, some have more of other things. And where you can actually get these at, all right, there's several places. Uh, you can get them daily. You get the card flips after you win arenas. You can get them from there. Uh, you can get them from rune chest as well. I believe I do have some in my bag. Look under the treasure tab, yes. Uh, so these are some that were giving away from completing, I believe, matches for this week. All right, we got a defense and a MB water rune. So we got three more blue runes there. And you can actually buy them as well. If you're already on the runes tab, click buy, and it will take you to the rune tab in the shop. Now, if you don't know how to get there without going through that, you can just click on the shop and just click on the runes tab and it'll take you there. Now in the shop, you do have room packs, which it will randomly give you one, or you can buy the assigned ones, whichever ones you want to go with. Now these do cost arena tokens. Now these are the only ways you can actually buy these. Uh, I really don't know any other ways, except for sometimes they might have them in a promotion. Uh, as you see right here, you can buy some of these with diamonds, but other than that, that's the only way to get them. Now I'm gonna go back and go into here and i'm going to unequip these because we're looking at building a set for my basically my tank so i'm going to go with a lot of dodge hit points and defense uh maybe some life steal uh see what all we can get into i still want to get a little bit of crit as well because i do need to do damage and you can see i've already got two level three level four level twos okay and i've been running dodge uh magic defense and life steal on these I do have that physical defense down there, but I do want to keep that magic defense. So we're going to look at, let's see, upgrading dodge. I would need three more or two more. You need a total of three. So I've already got all of those at level two. Let's see if we have any other ones. No, we don't want the mana. Let's go back with the three right there. All right, I'm going to move on to these and see what we have. All right, we have a level three HP rune and two level twos, which is the crit and the attack speed. All right, those are fine currently. And so far, guys, I've only spent about 5,000 arena tokens on buying runes. So I haven't really put a whole lot into them yet. That's why we're going through today to kind of look at them. All right, level two dodge, level two regen, and the rest of them are level one. So I want to look at, let's see. Let's go look at the earth runes and see what we can find. All right, we've got crit, magic power, Magic Power Regen, you have HP Regen, so that might be something I want to look at because I do want to get some HP Regen going, that way I'm always regaining hit points. Uh, HP Rune, Magic Defense, and Dodge, okay so there is a Dodge in there as well. Actually you know what, let's go ahead and pick up three Dodges, that way we can upgrade it to a level 2 Dodge Rune. As you can see there it's going to cost 597. So instead of the one, it's going to cost 200. If you buy two, you're going to get a discount. And if you buy three, you're going to get a little bit more of a discount. It's not very much, but hey, just buy them in multiples if you're going to do that because it's more beneficial for you. 
All right, so we need to go in here and let's look at the earth runes. And let's see, we had one dodge already that we were using, so we have three here. All right, you see the times three beside dodge. We're gonna go to the craft button. Yes, we're gonna save that room configuration because they're already out. And we're gonna open up the earth runes. And this is how you craft runes. Uh, it's basically how you level them up. The top level you can go to is five, so it's one through five. And here are our three dodges. I'm gonna put it in, craft them, and it's going to make a level two dodge rune. And you can just click on runes, go back to it, and we'll open up the earth tab. And we now have HP regen, dodge, and well, okay, that's the dodge. And we need one more for that. So we're still missing another level two for earth. Um, all right, let's go see what we have. All right, we have the crit, MP, MP. We don't need magic power. Uh, the regen, that's what we were gonna go for. So we've already actually got one of those, right? And it's at, yes, level two. So let's actually see if we can't find something else. If not, we'll go with a double dodge on that because I wanna see how well dodge actually works, see if it's a good build for uh, the game. So you know what, let's just go ahead and buy three more of them. As you can see, the prices doesn't change on them. It looks like you can buy as many as you want to daily. All right, and let's go back to craft and let's craft these last two and get them all in here there we go all right back to runes all right now let's inset these earth runes now these are just these lower smaller level ones and okay that is twice i've crafted them and they've not went into the earth runes category actually they have you see i now have four at dodge two so what we're going to do we're going to do something pretty awesome we're going to make a level three so we're going to craft go back to earth I don't know why I didn't pick up on that. Just pay attention to those numbers. That's one thing. We didn't have to spend those much, but now we have a level three dodge room. That's awesome. All right, so now we can actually go back to earth. Now we have the three, two, and two. So we're gonna inset those and we're gonna save it. And let's take a look at the next ones, which are the wind runes. Uh, currently cooldown, HP, magic pierce, magic regen, and magic all right so let's go take a look we already got cooldown and hp that we've been using there's another hp we got physical attack attack speed now attack speed might be something because i've only really got one attack when i'm using uh dread so let's try to increase that attack speed all right let's go over to craft okay save that room configuration and collapse that open up wind runes and we now have three attack speed runes go ahead and pop all those in there there we go level two rune all right now button at the bottom will actually collapse them as well oh we're in wind runes and we now have three level two runes that we can equip and finally for the last ones the spirit runes which are the most powerful out of all of them and you've got a lot more choices here. You can pretty much buy just about anything. I've got a level four dodge rune and the rest of them are level one. So I'm gonna go ahead and equip that dodge rune cause we're definitely gonna keep it. I've got another level one dodge, but let's take a look in the store and let's see how many of the purples or the spirit runes are actually in here. Take a look at all this. All right, we've got a crit rune, magic power, magic defense, and just look at the numbers on these. These are a lot higher than the other runes. So these are pretty much your core runes where you're gonna get a lot of your uh, stats from. High crit, which is two times crit, and that's only 0.3%. HP regen, more dodge, and the dodge on that is 0.5%, so that is a lot. Now these runes, yes, they do cost a little bit more, but that is okay because they are a lot better. They have more stats to them. Uh, physical, movement speed, and that's m might be something I need to look at, but attack interval and attack speed, my goodness. You just have so many options when it comes to this right here. So we're gonna go back and actually, I'm gonna double up on dodge in this. And three runes from that are gonna call 747 arena tokens. So we're gonna go back, save the rune configuration, craft it and let's go down here and craft this all right so we can create two more of these which will give us double the uh, dodge 
basically. All right, I'm gonna craft these other two as well. Get them in there. All right, now we have two level twos and a level four dodge that we could inset. And I could go back and spend more on that as well, but I've only got one open. So we're just gonna drop in this one double dot, uh, dodge right here. And once I get this next one unlocked, which should be a few more matches, yes, we'll save that room configuration. I'll be able to add that last one in and I'll probably have it leveled up by then. But also look here, you have, it says room case. All right, you can rename it and let me get this out of the way. And you can also buy another one. It's only 10 crystals to buy another rune set. And you can swap them in between matches. If you uh, look here, I'll pop into an AI match just to show you. Once you select your hero, you're able to change room cases. So you'll be able to go through them here, change them just as you can your perks. So that is a pretty much your only other way of standing out in the arena is from your runes. So you've got your runes, you've got your perks and your in-game build that you build once you're playing in the arena. Those are the only three things that stand you out from any other player in the arena. If you have any questions on this, guys, these are the runes. Uh, let me know in the comments below. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day.